YouTube, hey, how's it going? We're back with another Mario World video series. Lord Pickle World, made by Minnie Mawile. Um, I believe that's how you pronounce that. Uh, this is a Super Mario World hack made for Lord Pickle King, a talented Mario Maker player, and I think he's getting into ROM hacks, I'm not really sure. Also, this intro has the DuckTales theme song, and that already makes me think this is good. I love the DuckTales theme song. I think it's the best theme in cartoons. I don't know. What do you guys think? Anyway. Let's get started. People of Shroomland are starving. You will not be saving the princess, but literally anyone else. She can stay kidnapped. Okay, let's save literally anyone else. Then Jack's Hut. Due to the physics of the custom blocks, wall jumping has been disabled. Also, LR scrolling becomes me. She's island theme here. Memo Battleground. Oh shoot. I'm very dead. Okay, so this is Link to the Past music, I believe. Dude, there's just stuff everywhere. What the heck? Dude just was like, see you later. I'm gonna jump off the cliff. Ah. I do believe this game has no invisible Kaizo blocks. Um, they're all going to be outlined. I love that. I don't like invisible blocks. I like them as an obstacle. I just don't like that they're invisible. So if you can see them, Great. Why do these dudes just... Yeah, they just go crazy and jump off. I imagine we need to do this. Well, that was a mistake, but it worked. There's fire everywhere. Cool, checkpoint. That was quick. Looks like I need a P-switch or something, let the chuck out. Oh, these are like one-way gates, I guess. Ah. I gotta time him- I gotta time his jumps with the fire from the Simo dude. P-switches in this game last 10 seconds, by the way. If you're used to Mario Maker, they last, um... About 9 seconds in there, but 15 in this game. Oh my goodness, that was close. I think I just need to keep going there. This difficulty's pretty cool so far, I'm, I'm digging it. That was close. Oh, he just... Ran off the cliff. How did he do that? Okay. Uh, the thing with the chucks, I believe, is if their hands are on the ground and you jump over their head, they will jump. Ah. Um. So yeah. The reason why I keep jumping, like, I like to jump multiple times, is I believe... Don't quote me on this, I'm not an expert. I believe the way they work is if they're in the air and you're above their head, they will jump right when they land. Ooh, that was close. Oh my gosh. No! <laughs> I thought I had to spin off that guy, because you can spin off springs in Mario World. But it looks like I just needed to jump off to the right. Ah, 
That was bad. Because bullet launchers are weird. You have to have so much of the launcher itself on screen for it to be able to shoot. Oh, man. Come on. Just get this. This part's not hard. We died so many times at the end, but we got it. The level was pretty cool. Still sub 10 minutes, not bad. Ooh, two exits here. Wall jump heights. Okay. These orange star blocks can be jumped off of. Go in the door to try it out before you inevitably die. Pretty sure I know how these work, but... What is this song? I recognize this song, but I can't think of what it's from. Oh, shoot. Oh, this is from New Suit. <laughs> New Super Mario Bros. I gotta let that lower a little bit. Oh, there's stuff up there. Can I... I feel like there's a secret... Oh, maybe that's the training area down there. Or up there. Yeah, that's probably what that is. I thought that might be where the secret exit was, but... I don't think it is. Wall jumps are so weird, like, they work, but they're not the same as, like, New Super Mario Bros, because you can't slide on the wall like you do in that game. Uh, so it works a little differently. jump with that wall jump while holding the key? I can, okay. I was like, oh, this is gonna be crazy hard, but oh, this won't be too bad. Nice. Okay, we gotta get the normal exit now. really played Yoshi's Island. I played it as a kid, like we rented it, but I don't really remember anything. I probably had it for a few days. And that's it. one shot it. 
This part's fun. So close. Whoops. Another shot. This feels a lot like Mario Maker. It's kind of funny. Except the wall jumps are a little bit more janky, but that's because they're not meant to be in this game. the end. Wow, that level took less time than the previous one. It had two exits. Oh, that was so fun. Love these gimmick stages and hacks. Alright, we got the Switch Palace here. Green Jungle Palace. Oh, God. Did something very wrong, I think. Uh, I think I do that, maybe. A lot of Link to the Past music in this game. I've never played Link to the Past though, so... Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. Okay, so I gotta bring both of these vines to the top, I imagine. in there, okay. We done? Looks like we did it. Hey! Oh, I need the shell! Rip. Okay, well if I would have brought the shell, we would have won. That was pretty simple. Good difficulty. No. Well, I, I think it doesn't matter, right? How do I... There we go. <laughs> yeah, you can, um, climb vines while holding items in this game if you're not aware. Hopefully I don't need the shell in here. I don't even think you can bring the shell in here. I'm gonna get trolled. Why do I feel like I'm gonna get trolled? Yo, we got a yump! That was pretty quick. Bad, not bad. All right, so looks like we're going in this pipe wherever this goes. Okay, this is a song. Guillotine Caverns. I don't know what music that is. Oh snap. Why are these saws coated in red? They did a poor job of painting them? What's the deal with that? Oh. 
Oh, gosh. I need to get up on that block. Holy crap, this is intense. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I thought I wasn't going to be able to get the checkpoint. Wow, that was fast. Oh. Okay, I think I do need to hit that invisible block to let the other saw be allowed to move. Oh. <laughs> I missed. Definitely need to hit it. There we go. Oh. Oh. No. Why were those there? I thought I had to go hit them. I was really confused, but I think maybe that was for like de cheesing or something. to hit that. Oh. Shoot. Okay. Hopefully I don't need both saws. Ooh, that was scary. Oh my god. <laughs> cool. We're blowing through this game. Nice. That level was sweet. That was really fun. Oh man. Oh, there's a pipe over there. What's up with that? Deep Desert Oasis. Ooh. Seems kind of weird to have a desert in the middle of this cave, but... Eh. Who am I to judge Mother Nature? Okay. I think I'll just do that. But time it better than what I did. God, swimming with items is so hard in this game. I'll say that's one thing they definitely did better in Makers, the swimming with item physics. <laughs> it's so awkward. That block, huh? Shoot. No, wait. Oh, maybe this gives me a shell and I throw the shell there and bounce. Okay. I think that's what I do. God, it worked. Okay. Yeah, baby! One shot that part. Oh. Go ahead and de 
despawn yourself, sir. Oh my goodness. What these platforms? What are they gonna do? Ah. Oh my god, that was luck. Three, four, five, six. Ah, oh, why didn't I get up there? What the heck, Mario? There we go. You haven't noticed this water slowly pulling me to the left this entire time. Hey, do I gotta spin off that as it's falling into the water? I think maybe I can. Didn't need to though. Current, stop pulling me. Oh, this is... Okay. Now I like the current. Cool. <laughs> that was a strange level. It is cool. Yeah. We're blowing through this game, I'm telling you. This is awesome. Alright, what we got here? First castle. Ben's bedroom. I don't know who Ben is. But let's see what it's like. Ooh. I think this is the castle music from New Super Mario Bros. Ooh, okay. Why are the saws blue, by the way? Everything's blue. Even those spikes, look how blue they are. Man, that's kind of tricky, actually. Oh. <sighs> Man, that was bad. That goes all the way up. Okay. <laughs> no. That's crazy. Dude, I'm really loving the level design in this game so far. The difficulty's great. Not too hard, not too easy. These levels have all been very, very fair. Man. There we go. We got a, like, five at this part. Okay. Oh, God. What the heck is this? Whoa! How am I gonna get through this? Okay. Easier than I thought. Oh. <laughs> no! 
that was the checkpoint. Oh, man. I hate when that happens. It wasn't even a hard part. <laughs> okay. Right, so this part's not as hard as it looks. You can just jump over the saws. Well, apparently you can also hit the ceiling spikes. Nice. Okay, so don't jump too high when I jump over the saws. No. Ah, oh, man. Alright, just jump over the saws. Easy. Man. Also need to not fall in the lava. I should have said it out loud. Apparently if I don't, I don't know to not die to it. Jump over the saws, don't fall in the lava. Easy. Hey, we did it. Yes, checkpoint. Okay. Yoshi's Island, boss. The Wendy fight. Pretty simple pattern to not die from. <laughs> well, good luck hitting her there. Nice! Oh, that was a cool boss. It was a little easy. Maybe if there was like a fireball bouncing around, potaboo, lava bubble, whatever you want to call it. Right. Um, well guys, it was very quick, but that's the end of World 1. I guess that ends it for this video guys, we finished World 1. Uh, I'm loving this game, difficulty's great, level design's great, uh, it's very fun. I'm sure it's going to get harder as it goes. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate that you guys watch my stuff. I really do. Um, thank you so much. And yeah, stay tuned for the rest of this game. We'll take down Kojin no Dokutsu. I probably said that wrong. Yep, see you guys.